what's up YouTube and uh, thank you again for visiting my channel this is Mark Peely the ultimate Peely boy oh yeah and uh, thank you very much for those people who subscribed uh, on my channel and took time to watch my first video in YouTube um, it's named uh, welcome to my YouTube channel <laughs> so it's an introduction video um, from me for this channel as one of the you know newbie youtubers here and I uh, hope you, if you have time later on after you're done with this video I hope you could visit that video and try to hit like and and if you're not subscribed kindly hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell um, the reason that uh, I'm so excited today is I want to share with everyone uh, my new watch that I got from uh, time studio okay Time Studio is located in second floor at Market Market, Bonifacio Global City. Uh, I, I got a Seiko SKX007K2 version. Um, I tried to look for the J version. Uh, I think K, J stands for, Jap for Japan. Um, and uh, you know, that, that, that's one of the original ones that were released before. Um, and then the, the reason why I tried to have this kind of you know model or watch uh, is because I heard that the, this line particular model line has been discontinued and it's being replaced now by Seiko 5 sports models and I, I find it both similar but you know it, it's really different if you have the the iconic one the the, the first of the original watches uh, or, or batches of diverse diverse watches so uh, finally, I got one. Um, I tried to look for other shops in SM Aura uh, and uh, also some of the department stores there. Um, but Time Studios um, price is really, really competitive um, to the sense that it's really budget friendly. So I decided to purchase it from uh, Time Studio. So again, I'm so excited for everyone uh, to, to witness the unboxing of the watch. And why did I choose SKX007? Um, it's because it's it's a very iconic watch, and um, it's my first diver's watch. Uh, I, I remember my dad to have like two to three diver's watches. It, it looked like them, uh, and I, I really have no interest before on on diver's watches, and now it, it kind of uh, really uh, you know build up the the hype uh, from within me to purchase one, and now I have one. So if, if uh, everyone is ready, I'll go ahead and start with our quick unboxing of the Seiko SKX007 K2 version. All right, so let's get the watch out from the paperback. So it's a gray box. Okay. Well, let's see what's inside. Okay, so this is the watch itself. So this is the K2 version. So it has a Jubilee bracelet. So let's put the watch aside. Let's see. So it has the instructions or manual. So if you're a first time Seiko uh, watch holder, I think if you have the time, then it would be best if you could run through some of the details here for awareness. <laughs> and the last page, it has the warranty card that I got. Okay. So it says here it's one year warranty, outer parts not covered, and the serial number of the watch. It says the name of the shop and the place where I bought it. Uh, the mall, actual mall place. So if you have that, make sure you keep it just in case. And let's check out the watch. So this is again the SKX007, a K2 version. So this is the Jubilee bracelet. There you go. So it's really, really classic in terms of the designs. Very iconic. Um, you could also see that the, the watch face is really covered in crystal. Uh, it's a crystal watch face and uh, also it's ISO 6425 rated. Uh, it's water resistant to 200 meters. Okay, And this watch is an automatic one. 
It doesn't require any batteries. The movement of this is Japanese 7S26. And also the crown is isolated. It's uh, actually in the four o'clock part. Okay. You have to scroll it like that. You don't pull it like that. So we're, we're gonna teach you later on, uh, probably on a different video on how to adjust the time, the date, settings. Okay. So the Japan model usually has uh, made in Japan here on this side. While uh, if it's a K, uh, a K model, it's just some numbers. So again, the, the size of the this particular watch is 43 mm, not including the crown. And also with regard to the bracelet, you can actually customize it. It's uh, 22 mm lugs. So if you have, if you're really, you know, into a lot of bracelets, you know, it's, it's really easy to replace. So let's remove it from the pillow. There you go. Place on the side. Other side. It's really beautiful. So there you have it. Now, since this is a 43 uh, mm size, and if you have, let's say, a smaller uh, wrist, um, SKX007 has a smaller version. It's uh, SKX013. So it's only a 38 mm uh, size watch. It's, uh, it's, it's pretty much the same, like everything is just smaller. So if you think that the 007 model is big on your wrist, then you could purchase the, the, the smaller version, just the 013. So let's try to fit it. And see. Have to be careful. There you go. It's not that heavy and it's not that big on your wrist as well if you're used to wearing big watches uh, you're gonna feel a little bit of you know um, I don't know what's the term but it, it might feel something different <laughs> but it, it won't take long for you to adjust and uh, you can wear this even with formal attire or casual attire or you know even Simplest, um, simple as simple or it's again it, it's it's a beater wash as they say. So I, I really love um, this watch and I'm sharing it with everyone. So if you're planning to buy one in the future, at least um, you could uh, in the, you know what how to. Uh, what to expect inside the box and at the same time some of the features basic 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 features okay so there you have it thank you very much for watching and again if you haven't subscribed to this channel please hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you have any uh you know comments please leave it down on the comment section and we'll try to respond to you guys as soon as possible Thank you very much and have a great day, everyone. Be safe. Thanks.
Hey everyone, again, thank you for um, supporting my first video in YouTube and also to those people who uh, subscribe and hit the like button and also put some positive comments and uh, also took time to watch the video. Thank you very much. I um, really want to start with my, the, the people in our office, um, the Bad Six, you guys rock. Um, also some uh, friends within the same floor, we have Diane and Precious, thank you very much. Um, also, um, some of my, um, what do you call this, some of my uh, uh, friends back in uh, uh, my, my other office, so we have Joper uh, and also JM, thank you very much for supporting, appreciate uh, your time on, on even sharing the video and uh, also uh, putting a comment on, on uh, what do you call this, uh, on my YouTube page. And actually, there's a lot of there's a lot of uh, uh, names that uh, uh, you know popping up in my head. Really can't mention every everyone, but thank you uh, for for my department. You know who you guys are. Thank you for uh, supporting and for those people who left uh, a message in in my YouTube page. Again, thank you very much. Um, looking forward for your support on uh, my ne next video and uh, you guys rock thank you very much and have have a blessed day bye